there. I hope you're having a great day. I certainly am. And as promised, in today's video, I'm going to share with you some of my tips and tricks on how I get through my day every single day, motivated, happy, pep in my step. I have a smile on my face. I love to live an active and healthy lifestyle. And I really think I have some secrets that you can employ in your everyday life that will just help you get it all done. I want to say a huge thank you to One A Day Vitamins for sponsoring today's video. Now, tips and tricks on how to get it all done with a smile on your face and a pep in your step. Hey babe. Hey. It's going to be really nice tomorrow. Let's take the dogs to the dog park so Pollux can show off what he's learned at training. Ooh, that'd be a good idea. Yeah. You ready for a snack? Sure am. Okay, wait. Don't forget, you got to take your vitamin. We are super glad to be partnered with One A Day Multivitamins. We have to stay healthy so that we can continue to do the things we love, like take our dogs to the park and be active. And I want us to be able to continue to live our best lives and to do it together. I like One A Day Multivitamins for us because they are specifically made for women and men over the age of 50. And that's us, right babe? Yeah. I cannot believe we are in our 50s, but we are. Time really flies. And I think it's really great that One A Day Vitamins are formulated with all of the good stuff that we want and none of the bad stuff that we don't want. Like high fructose corn syrup, we don't want that. And I appreciate the fact that there is a man's vitamin for him and a woman's vitamin specifically for me because I need more calcium than he does. B vitamins are really good for us. It is. It really is. B vitamins are really great for healthy brain function, which is something honestly that I worry about now that we're getting older. You can get one a day, 50 plus complete multivitamins at Walmart and links are in the description box below this video. And we truly want to say thank you again to one a day for sponsoring today's video. Yeah. I start my day every single day with breakfast. I know there are so many people that say, I just, I don't eat breakfast, I don't want breakfast, I'm not hungry. I am not one of those people. I wake up hungry after I've had a cup of coffee. I have to have my breakfast. And I have several go-to breakfasts. I have four things that I generally rotate among the days so that I never get burnt out, I, get, I never get tired of the same breakfast, and it just gets me going. It starts my day out great. And you all have heard me talk about some of these things before, but I'm gonna show you my favorite four breakfast ideas. So one of the things I love for breakfast is my Kashi peanut butter cereal. I'm a peanut butter lover, y'all. I love this cereal. It just makes me feel good. It's full of creamy peanut butter. This is one of my go-tos, and my daughters love this cereal too, so this is always a staple in our house. Another cereal that I love, Cascadian Farms Organic Honey Oat Crunch. I love this stuff. I love to put fruit in my cereal and raspberries. I always have raspberries. So my go-to is Honey Oat Crunch with raspberries. I'll put bananas in it. I will put blackberries in it when they're in season. I just love fruit in my cereal. It makes me happy because of all the bright colors. I love the taste of the fruit and the crunch and the oats in this cereal. Cascadian Farms, another go-to breakfast. And in both of my cereals, I put oat milk. I've been drinking oat milk for years. I love it. If you have never tried oat milk, you really should give it a whirl, give it a go. It is so much thicker and creamier, very much like real milk, where I find for me that almond milk and coconut milk is just kind of thin and watery, and I don't love it. But once I discovered oat milk, this is my go-to. The next thing I eat for breakfast every morning is oatmeal. I love oatmeal. And I'm a simple kind of gal. I just make oatmeal. I put a little bit of brown sugar in it and then a dab of my oatmeal just to kind of loosen it up a little bit. It's quick. I feel like it's hearty. It fills me up. It makes me feel good. And so oatmeal is another one of my go-to breakfasts. So the next thing I love for breakfast, if I'm in the mood to kind of whip something up, is an avocado toast with an egg. Y'all, 
If you have never tried this, you have got to do it. A couple little tips and tricks if you do avocado toast. I keep it simple, y'all. I don't go crazy. I just take my avocado, chunk it up, put it on a piece of whole wheat toast. Then I have a couple seasonings that I like to put on it. If you have ever been to a Trader Joe's, they have everything but the bagel sesame seasoning. Y'all, this stuff rocks. Sprinkle a little, a bit of this on top of your avocado, and then I will put a little bit of red pepper flakes, just so it has a little bit of zing to it. Now, you can do a fried egg, you can do a scrambled egg, whatever suits you is perfectly fine. But then I top it off with roasted and salted almonds. Hear me out. If you just take like five almonds, put them in a little Ziploc bag, beat them with a the meat mallet until they're all crunched up, and then just sprinkle it over the top of your egg. It is the perfect, crunchy, salty topping to an avocado toast sandwich. Love it. So those are my four go-tos for breakfast. I just, whatever my mood is, I always have something I like. And everything I eat is pretty hearty. It makes me feel good. I'm not eating a big breakfast full of sugar and a bunch of junk. Pretty much everything I eat will stay with me for several hours. And I like to eat breakfast pretty early on in the morning, like eight o'clock. Then throughout the day, y'all, I'm a snacker. I am not somebody that can just eat three meals a day and, and be satisfied. I'm just not. I have to snack. And I want to eat snacks that are filling. They're good for me. I try not to eat like like I would never just pick up a candy bar and eat it as a snack. It's just not gonna happen. Anytime I am looking for a snack or anytime I leave my house, there are two snacks that I always take with me. It's just, it, it is just my go-to and here's what they are. The first one is Blue Diamond Almonds and Fruit. Now this is apparently a new product. I have only noticed this being um, in my grocery store for the past couple of months, three, four months or something. I am addicted to this stuff. But it is sea salt, almonds, and whole blueberries. The perfect, salty, sweet, crunchy little snack. A handful of these little babies, and I am so good to go. Now they do come in a different flavor. Fiery Ghost Red Pepper Almonds and Tart Cherries. I'm not necessarily a spicy person, but Randy loves these. I buy a bag of these every week at the grocery. He keeps them in his car. So this is actually what he eats for breakfast, believe it or not. But when he's out, he does a lot of driving for work. He just grabs these almonds and the cherries and he loves them. They're not overly super spicy. If you were to just eat the almond by itself, it does have a little bit of zing. But when it's offset by the tart cherries, it's the perfect combination. The perfect bite to me is two almonds and one blueberry. They're so good. The blueberries are not dried. They're not dry. They're still juicy inside. I don't know how they do it, but they're whole blueberries, super sweet with the crunchy almond, not too salty. I just love these things. So if you see these in your grocery, definitely grab a bag. Whatever suits your fancy, spicy or sweet, but these are great. The next snack that I take with me on the go, and hear me out, just hear me out. <laughs> Superfood Bites by Urban Foods. Okay, you can tell by now that I love blueberries, but these wild blueberry and honey treats are so good. They are full, and this is where you're gonna be like, eee! I don't know about it, but I promise these are so good. They make you feel like you're eating so healthy and it, this is a very filling little snack, but they're made of quinoa, chia, flaxseed, and oats. And these also come in two flavors. There is the wild blueberry and honey and cranberry and orange. If you're somebody who's like, I'm not gonna eat chia seeds. I promise y'all, give it a try. But let me show you what these look like. They're these little, can you see that? Little bite-sized squares. And each little square has blueberries and everything you need in there. It's like the seeds are held together with honey. 
and then you have the sweet blueberry, the sweet honey, then you have the hearty seeds, and they're just fantastic. So the almonds and the superfood bites are my go-to snack. Anytime I leave the house, I take one of those two bags with me. I am a mid-morning snacker and a mid-afternoon snacker, and this is what and this is my go-to always. So it keeps me fueled and energized. I feel like I'm eating healthy. I am eating healthy. I'm not eating junk food. I'm not eating a candy bar or chips or something that's going to help me for 20 minutes and then I'm just going to kind of crash and burn. I really am getting a lot, a lot of good healthy energy from these two different snacks. So give them a try. My next trick, y'all. Water! As soon as I finish my coffee in the morning, my second cup of coffee, I fill up one of these with water. I drink on this all day long. It's got ice in it. I fill it with water. I just, I fill this up endless amounts of times all day long. I'm constantly drinking water. If I leave my house, this goes with me. Like I almost get in a little bit of a panic if I don't have water with me. And I love the Arctic brand coolers. Arctic brand insulated beverage holders, they keep my ice ice all day long. I can be gone for hours and I still have ice. I don't really want to drink water out of a bottle. I don't like room temperature water. There's no need to go through all of the bottles of water. I just fill up my Arctic when I leave over and over and over again. I love these Arctic beverage coolers. They come in different sizes. I have a big one and a small one. I have different colors. See, Randy bought us a huge pack of these. They're just fantastic. The smaller size just has the little hole for my reusable straw. And then the larger Arctics actually have a lid that opens and closes. So you can, if you don't have your straw in there, you can snap it shut. It's not gonna spill. And then I just drink water all day long. And you'll notice I have reusable straws. I do not like drinking out of those metal straws that have the little rubber tip on them. They just give me the heebie-jeebies. And so I have these kind of plasticky reusable straws. I bought a huge package of them in all these little fun colors. And so I just pop them in the dishwasher every day along with my Arctic cup, get out a new one in the morning, and I am good to go. So hey, I'm out and about for the day. I'm dressed. I'm ready. I have a bunch of errands to do. I have to go to the ice cream shop today and I've got my snacks and my water. So I'm all set. I've even got my lunch because I'm not going to be able to eat lunch out. I never eat lunch out. I always have my lunch or I eat at home. But I'm excited to show you all my two other things that I do every single day that just make me happy. They make my heart full. They keep me energized and I cannot wait to get home tonight to show you those two things. The next thing that I do every single day that just makes me happy, it it's just, it truly energizes me and that is to be with this guy, Pollux, my dogs, Maxie. Maxie's taking a Judy in the other room. They truly are they truly are. Oh, he doesn't want me to do it. They truly are my best friends. I love to be with them. I love to walk my dogs. And on days when I can't walk my dogs, if it's raining or it's really cold like it is today, I always get in the floor and I play with them. I snuggle with them. We throw the ball. We play with toys. <laughs> Whatever it is, but just being with them truly makes me happy. It fills my heart and it's something that I have to do. Right, Pollux? Every single day. I got a kiss on him like this. Oh, he didn't want me to. It's just what I have to do. I have to spend time with my doggies. It's dinner time. That's why Pollux is like, oh no. But let's see what the movie's doing. Moo. You're here to moo. See, I just have to pet them and love them. It just, they make me so happy. They are my best friends. They're part of me. I want to be with them. I want to snuggle with them. I want to kiss on them. Mm, little Mooey, he's got in his little new shirt. And I just always carve out time in my day to spend with my dogs. 
If you're a cat person, a dog person, if you have a fish, whatever it is, find time every day. Even if it's only two or three minutes, if that's all you can spare, just do what makes you happy every single day. Right, Mooey? Now, it's dinner time around here, which means Randy is going to be home in a minute. <laughs> And that leads me to the last thing that I do every single day that is, is part of me. It makes me full of joy. It makes me smile. And I'll tell you when Randy gets home. But for now, I'm going to feed these guys. Mary, are you loving the t-shirt? Randy is pulling in the garage from work. He has no idea I'm going to have the camera on. Who is it, Pugs? You can have a little different one today. <laughs> hey, Pollins. And there he is. We was waiting on you, Daddy. Get him, Mim. When pigs fly. Get him out of here, Mooey. Oh, get him, get him. <laughs> and the last thing I do every day is eat dinner with this guy. We eat dinner together. It's what we do. We talk about our day. We just, we don't know, we just chat it up. But my point is have a meal with somebody you love. Have coffee with somebody you love. And it can be your mother, your daughter, your son, your best friend. It can be anybody, your neighbor, just somebody that makes you laugh, somebody that makes you smile, somebody that makes you feel good. Have a cup of tea, have lunch, have a snack, have dinner. I don't know, but this is who I eat my meals with every single night. And I love it. I would have it no other way. So thanks for joining me in my video today about energy. This is actually a two-part video about energy. Now you know all my secrets, my tips, my tricks, what I do to just stay energized and full of life every day. So I'll see you later.